Hey everyone, this is Connor Gamer here with some post commentary for Crash Bash, and on this part I started off in Warp Room 5 and I started with the level Splash Dash. Now, my thoughts on this level, well, this is not one of my favourite levels in this game, purely because of a few things. First of all, the turntable that appears there in the middle, that can be very cheap, you never know when the the pillars are going to open and they send you flying off. And also, um, another reason as well, you're racing on sea creatures, I understand that you're underwater, but the thing is, you don't, yeah, and I actually had to cut this as well because I failed uh, on the first attempt for the trophy. But, um, what I um, think is that it's just a, it's a bit pointless in my opinion racing on sea creatures, I mean, uh, I may be wrong, but the thing is, it's not my favourite uh, dash level. This is my, my least favourite out of all the four. As I said before, I mean, Toxic Dash is my favourite. This one, I don't like. I just don't like this level at all, period. Because, and another reason for this as well, which I'll get to um, once I've got the first trophy, well, once uh, the first trophy's been collected here, um... Now, I'm going to make a statement right now on Crash Bash, on the future of it. Now, I did say that I was going to be getting all the Platinum Relics. Well, I've got something to tell you. Now, before I come to this, um, this is what I'm going to be talking about, is another reason why I don't like this level. And you'll see once it starts. Now, Koala Kong got a goal already, and he never went round once. And that's a glitch. And that's a very unnecessary glitch in my opinion, but luckily Koala Kong was uh, stupid enough to fall off. Well, not only once, but twice. But anyway, um, that's the kind of glitch I don't like in this. It's just, it's really unfair. I don't know why on earth it's like, oh, he's winning, let's just glitch so he doesn't win. <sighs> Sorry, but I nearly lost control of this level, I just, I don't like this level at all. And. Yeah, speaking of my future about Crash Bash, now, the thing is, I did say I was going to be getting all the Platinum Relics. Well, I've got something to say right here. In my recordings, I actually tried to get the Gold Relic for this level, and honestly, the amount of times I failed at the Gold Relic was unbelievable. I mean, there were a few t rounds where I won the first round, but then the second round I completely lost because I kept falling off the arena. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'll still try and get the Platinum Relics, don't get me wrong, I'll still get them, I'm not saying I'm not going to get them, I'm saying I will try to get them, but the thing is, if the, pla if the Platinum Relic for a particular level takes up, like, to two full recordings that are worth 20 minutes, I'm not getting them, because I'm not going to waste my time at trying to get this if I can't do it. I know the practice makes perfect, but honestly, the Platinum Relics are, are very extreme to get, they really are. They are so hard. But, um, what I'm going to say is, I'm going to do the best that I can in this game. That's all I can say. If I don't get 200%, I don't care, quite honestly. Because I didn't say, as I said before at the beginning of this, I'm not planning on getting 200% for this. I know it seems pretty rewarding getting 200% for this, but it doesn't get you any extra characters or arenas or anything. But anyway, anyhow, um, that's, um, we got the trophy for, um, Splash Dash, and I'll see you next time when I get the gem. Till then, see ya.